just before we start today's video, the first comment will themselves a ultimate mystery box. So congrats to the one that, but for the main prize, I'm actually giving away a $100 donated pin to one lucky winner. If you want to be in for that, just leave a like on today's video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel with notifications on and comment your in-game name on near reality. And that's pretty much all you have to do to be entered. So good luck on that giveaway and I hope you guys enjoy today's video. Yo, what is up everyone and welcome back to Near Reality. So I already made a video on here a few days back basically announcing there'd be a group Iron Man competition and I actually decided to take part in the competition so I made a group with Nas, Kevin, Game and Duba who some of you guys will probably know if you watch my streams. And yeah, we're pretty much going to be going for like every single prize but mainly focusing on maxing first I believe so I hope you guys enjoy. Oh, it's no, oh, go, go to the chat channel, create group. Oh, it's in the, oh, yeah, it's in the clan channel. Okay, I'll invite you guys. Okay, okay wait, confirm. so I'm bank boost. Oh fuck, my app keys are messed up. What the hell? <laughs> right, we are, we're all in, we're all in, the group is full. Alright. Where's app keys? Okay, our group's made, our group's made. Alright, we're good. How do we leave? Um... <laughs> we're stuck. <laughs> Yo, how do we get out? Can we just... <laughs> teleport? Right here, it's a portal. North, north, north. North? North? Okay. Oh, there's a portal here. Okay. Ooh, nice, looks nice. That was actually a pretty oh, clean interface. Yeah, sick. Oh shit. Well. That's a new home. Where'd you guys go? Where'd you guys go? There's a pool like all the way north. Hey, I ain't voting for shit. Dude, vote. You'll get extra points. Hell no, you guys can vote and give me shit. <laughs> Whoa, we're gonna get banned? Wait, did they have Michael Bay or? Yeah, we won the 25k. Do the tutorial. Oh, it's free 25k! Free 25k! What the hell? Yeah, it's taking a long time. I don't know. It's definitely worth it. 25k is a lot. I'm actually voting. I thought I was never gonna vote in my life again, but I'm actually voting. Okay, yeah, let me vote as well. Yo, Diva, take take my logs. Trade. You're welcome. Oh, is that no construction? Nah. Yo, what's up, Zod? Mine's already is 995 making? There's no way. No, you don't need a chisel. That's what not... is wrong with you? Bro, have you guys cool. never done woodsod before? Like, come on. No, he said, are you ready? Are you ready? And did it. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> this is it. Alright, here is our first 99 on the group I am in. 99 fire making. So, there it is. What? So, he has achieved level 99. So, I decided to do 99 fire making my first thing because I want to do it while still low HP. So, it's pretty efficient, but. We got two GZs as well, Pog. All right, that should be 30 press. I literally just used regular bones on this altar right here. And I actually did all the easy tasks from the other one diary to get this lamp, but then I figured I actually need a level 30 and it's got to use it. So we're gonna test how much XP we get from this. Hopefully it's a lot. 10K XP, damn. I think it was to 35, that's not the worst. If we do like two more easy sets of diaries, we could probably get all the way up to 43. All right, this better give me a lot of hunter XP, please. Okay, 31 hunter from that. I can already eat birdhouses with that. All right, there is all my easy Kandarin achievements done. So I just did an inventory of big wings at Hell Giants, which got me to 41, and I don't want to go back again. So I thought I'd just do some more achievements to get the lamp from that. Uh, these are my current stats, by the way. We're 925 total right now. Doing pretty well, just been training some random stats, random slam, but there is my reward. Oh, we got Kandarin headgear as well. All right, let's use this on prayer. This should give me 43. Oh nice, we're like 100 XP or 44 as well. Okay, we'll take that. All right, we finally have access to protection prayers now. That's huge. All right, there's 1,000 total level. We just got 40 smithing. I think my daily challenge for today, which if you guys didn't know about, you can do daily challenges. It's in the game notes board right here. One today is to craft off a necklace. I already bought the sapphires using Tockle, but I actually needed 40 smithing just to make gold bars to actually make the necklaces, which I didn't think about. So got that now. And um, yeah, 1,000 total, it's really nice. Alright, so I left my account splashing overnight and I woke up to 78 magic, which is really nice. Um, it's not quite the level I wanted because I need 83 for fertile soil for like farmers and stuff, but at level 77 I can actually use super glass make and I'm pretty sure in here, to train my crafting at least, making molten glass is one of the best ways to do so, so I can actually start doing that and we could just train our magic all the way up to 83 just using the spell anyways, so that is actually really nice. All right, this should be 75 crafting, so we can now make slayer rings, we can make magic birdhouses. Honestly, a pretty huge level to get, so pretty much my crafting training method is since I got 78 magic from Splashing Overnight, I can actually use the super glass make, and all I do 
is I make a full inventory of molten glass with my glass blowing pipe right here. And then after you do that, just sell your lantern lenses straight back to the shop and just buy another 10 buckets of sand and soda ash and then get back to it. And it is honestly that simple. Right now I'm getting around 2 mil XP an hour. I've been a little bit inefficient, so I've dropped a little bit of XP, but yeah, 2 mil XP an hour. That's like, what, another 6 hours to 99. And then once I get 87, I think I can make light orbs instead of lantern lenses which should be even faster XP, so this is honestly really good. All right, there it is, finally, the full rogue. So literally Kevin, who's in my group, got full rogue by like level 62. Meanwhile, I'm like level 76, but there it is, full rogue. So I've pretty much only done master farming for the majority of this. I swear I've got all the seeds to do farming from. I'm level 65 farming just from thieving seeds from master farming pretty much. So you guys didn't know you can actually use the... Uh, Shadow Veil spell on the Arceus Spellbook to increase your chance for this, but yeah. We've racked up quite a few seeds, like for Lantidimes, like... We're honestly doing pretty well on Herb Seeds, but... Good thing about Full Rogue is, I'll just demonstrate. When you have the full set, all you pickpocket gets doubled. So let's just pickpocket one seed, so we get two Cactus Seeds, eight Potatoes, two Taramins, like... Our loot from here on out is going to be a lot better, so... I think the plan is we're going to continue here until we're level 80, and then we can move on to Heroes. And then elves, which will give us a lot of cash to be thieving with as well. So our first wilderness vaults. Okay. BLS in coming, please. Yo, I got three dragon long swords. Pog. Alright, we just hit 40 attack. That means we can wear our rune sword. You can buy this from the champion's guild, by the way. Um I would get a rune skimmy, but I think the only place you can get them from is Fire Giants at like a 1 in 128 drop rate, so probably not worth. I think I'm just going to train to 60 with a rune sword and then buy D skin from Apetor. That should be good. But yeah. Just hit 50 Slayer as well. Starts to come out nicely. And 1250 total. Yo, loads of milestones. Let's go. Alright, this should be 60 agility. So I thought I'd do the wilderness course for some levels since it is a lot faster than the cannabis course. But yeah, now we can move on to the Sears one. Nice. Alright, there's 75 farming. Now we can plant magic trees. Farming's coming along very nicely. Alright, another wilderness boss done. Come on. Please. Please, please, please. Oh, what is that? Wait, did you destroy it, Kevin? You must have destroyed it. Bro, there's pures out here! What the fuck? Yo! No way, there's pures. Bro! Bro, I'm being bolted! Bro! Why are there pures? Oh no. My dog is in crossbow, bro. Help. Someone get this guy off me, please. Bro, help. Bro. My blood money. Ain't no way. Guys, someone please ride this guy. No, and he just fucking wants. Nah, bro. I'm so sad. I'm actually so sad. Of course Kevin gets out and he's the only one who didn't actually get shit, I see for you. Alright, so apparently you can buy crystal keys for 10 slayer points, and these give you a guaranteed dragon stone. So I already got the crafting level to make this, but I didn't know I could actually get a dragon stone from doing that, so... I guess that's our glory done. Alright, here is our glory. So I got the ball of wool from his hideous, by the way. Amulet glory, there you go, nice. Alright, so apparently you can buy Barrow's gloves right from this chest without any accurate requirements. It does cost 130k, but... I think it'll be worth it. So, account's actually starting to look pretty nice now. Alright, there's 60 attacks, so now we can finally wield our D skim. So you can actually buy this from Apetor, if you if you didn't know. And uh, Nas actually got this black mask at like 50 KC from Gay Forest, which is very lucky. I didn't even have the well I just got this level to actually kill like Gay Forest myself, so I could go for my own one. We also bought this Rune Defender for three voting points, I think. And you get around three per day, so that's not too bad to get. Alright, that's 55 defense, so I actually got a Jelly Stars, and we decided to Ice Burst it. I'm getting a lot of magic speed, I'm very close to 83. Got some hit points levels, 64 Slayer as well, but yeah, 55 defense, we can now wear a Nezzy Helm, which is pretty nice. Alright, our first stone shun. I think I need three of these for an Arc Light. There's 83 magic, we got that right after we finished the task as well, so now we can actually do a Fertile Soul without having to use Wither's Mind Mobs, which is pretty damn nice, so. Another huge level. Alright, there we go. We just got 67 strength. Might not sound like much, but we also have 63 attack, which means we can now go in the Warrior Guild. So I bought the Rune Defender from the shop because it's only 3 vote points. You can also buy the Dragon Defender there as well, but the problem is it's 15 vote points, which is a lot more. So I think it's better off for me to just get the Dragon Defender from Warrior's Guild. I think it's like a 1 in 50 drop rate, which honestly isn't that much. So let's go get it. Another Worldy Vaults KC. VLS. 
pulls from? Bro, is this trash? Yo, that was easy. <laughs> I literally killed like four. I literally killed four. Let's go. Easy game. All right, nice. We just got 85 thieving. So we pretty much just got this Artie here. It's got a little bit of cash from it, but now that means we're going to move forward to elves, which are apparently really, really good thieving XP. All right, another wilderness vaults. Oh, we got some dark crabs. Okay, we'll take that. No way, we just got the world boss and we actually got 48 strength bows. If you're wondering why it just appeared on the ground, by the way, all you have to do is just um, hit it once and then you can literally be anywhere and the loot will just appear underneath you. So that is actually huge for my prayer. That might even get me to 70 prayer, honestly. All right, this should be the final thief for 99 thieving. So we've literally just been at L's for a pretty long time and I think it's definitely paid off. We got a lot of cash from this. Let's see exactly how much we got. Wow, we got two mil from that. Holy shit. All right. <laughs> Not bad, we'll take it. All right, so we're gonna use these Dragon Bones on the Wilderness Curse Halter. I've got my main, just in case anything happens. We're gonna use this Tome that we got from the Wilderness Boss as well, which gives us 15 minutes of bonus XP. Hopefully, we can use a lot of these bones. All right, nice, we actually got 70 prayers. So we can use Piety when we have the defense level for that. I'm only like seven defense levels off. I can probably just burst or something and get defense XP through that, so that's honestly really good. That's exactly the level I wanted to. Holy shit, you get 400k XP for a magic tree. That's actually insane. God damn. We're gonna be 99 farming in no time. All right, there's another wilderness vault done. 4k C, can we get something good? Come on. Bro, every time I get nothing, man. God damn it. All right, this should be a 70 agility. So now, since we got blue dragon stars for our Kona task, I can actually use that shortcut now, which is awesome. But yeah, that's a big level. Nice. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. We've been streaming like every single day for like literally 8 to 12 hours each day. Like I've been enjoying this server so much. If you haven't checked it already, definitely make sure to. The link is in the description below. Right now it's, there's like over 250 players online. It almost did 300 last night. So the server's doing really, really well. Definitely make sure to check it out. But apart from that, let's roll the giveaway from the previous video. So good luck to everyone.